G'day YouTube and welcome back to Step by Step Back to Basics. So we've just finished building seven of our 80 amp hour cells and we want to put them in a battery or a power supply. But before we do that, we need to balance the batteries to make sure we can utilize most of the power in those batteries. So the story goes top balance or bottom balance. Um, for 18650 batteries and 18650 cells, it's top balancing 100% of the time. So let's have a look at the graph and I'll explain why. So we understand from my battery testing video that our curve of the 18650 battery is really smooth starting at 4.2 volts all the way down to about 3.35 volts when we do get a sharp drop off. So we know we're never gonna go below 3.35 volts because it's not practical to do so. So then if we're not gonna totally discharge these batteries, we don't need to bottom balance them. But since we are going to totally charge these batteries all the way up to 4.2 volts when they're in series in a battery pack, that means we have to top balance them. So what happens is when we top balance these in parallel, we hook them all up, all the negatives to the negatives and all the positives to the positives, and we charge them to 4.2 volts. And so at 4.2 volts, the capacity in each of the batteries is even. And when you discharge them, all the way down to 3.35 volts, some of them will be at 3.35, some of them might be at 3.3, some of them might be at 3.4. But this doesn't matter about them being out of balance at a lower level because when they charge back up again, they will all balance out automatically up to 4.2 volts and will have full capacity. And this is why we want to go ahead and top balance 18650 batteries. So let's get back to it. So now we understand why we need to top balance these batteries. Let me go ahead and show you how we're going to do that. The first thing we're going to do is set all these batteries up in parallel. So let me go ahead and take care of that right now. Now that we have all our batteries hooked up in parallel, we have one big giant 4.2 volt 18650 battery, 560 amp hours. And um, now we understand why we need to top balance these batteries. Um, if we just leave them hooked up like this, they will balance themselves, but they won't top balance. The way we need to top balance is we need to charge them in parallel to 4.2 volts. So let me go ahead and hook up our EVC A20 uh, battery tester, which will also charge the batteries, and then we'll start charging. So let's go ahead and charge these batteries so we can get them top balanced. And what we're going to do is we're going to use our EVC A20 battery charger. So we need to go ahead and change the parameters here. We're going to use a constant voltage on this and we are going to change this um, it's maximum uh, amp is five amps for this particular charger but we need, do need to change this to four point two volts and we're going to do this until we're at uh, one amp and what that means is as it gets close to the end of the charging, these amps will actually drop as the batteries become saturated. And once it reaches uh, one amp, it will actually stop the charging and the battery itself will um, stop charging. Okay, let's go ahead and set that and start up and charge. So there we are. So at this point, we are top balancing these batteries and we understand why. So once again, YouTube, uh, thanks for watching Step by Step Back to Basics. And in our next video, we will be building that power supply with all of these top balance batteries. And as always, if you buy cheap, you will buy twice. And keep it simple whenever possible.